Welcome to part three of Beastly Birds and Bats by Lynn Hugens Cooper. Pe peculiar, peculiar predators. Some birds have horrible hunting habits. They may beat or peck their prey to death, or even push it onto branches or rocks. One bird even drinks the blood of other birds. Foul fact. The vampire French roll the, the newly laid eggs of other birds against a rock to beat them open. It, it then feeds on the content. Cuckoo burrs, burrows have a loud call that sound like hysterical laughter. Cuckoo bars, cuckoo bars live in Australia, New Zealand, and New New Guinea. The main, they mainly eat insects, worms, and crustaceans, but sometimes very vary their diet with small snakes, mammals, frogs, and birds. They pounce on their prey from a perch bashing a large victim against a branch or ground. Vampire finch. Vin, finch. The vampire finch lives on Wolf Island in Galapagos. It feeds on on blood and wings of other birds. It also eats the egg of seabirds called boobies. A vampire finch feeds on the blood of of a large bird. European bee eater. The European bee eater is migratory bird. It spends winter in warm places such as Africa, North India, and Sri Lanka. The su in the uh, in the summer in Europe, it eats bees, wasps, and hornets. Before eating the bee eater, before eating the bee eater hits the insects against its perch to knock out the knock off the sting. It just in just one day, the European bee eater eats as many as 250 bees. European bee eater builds burrows like nests, up to 5 feet, 1.5 meters long, in banks of cl or cliffs. Stinky birds. Some birds are known for causing a real stink. Whether it is the bird themselves, their eggs, or the mess they make with their faces, the smell can be really awful. Giant patrol regurgitate foul-smelling oil into their gravel's nest to keep predators at a distance. Giant patrols. Northern and southern giant patrols lay stinky eggs. It is believed that the egg smells to smell to keep predators away. Even after 100 years in a museum collection, the eggshell still shell smells. The body of the southern giant petrel has a strong musky smell too. It feeds mainly on dead seals and penguins as well as krill and squid. Foul fact. Starling guano is, is acidic and can damage buildings made for, of sandstone. Hoopos. Hoopos are found in Europe, Asia, and Africa. The hoopo makes a foul-smelling nest in a hole in a tree trunk or wall. It adds lots of feces. It it adds lots of feces to the nest to keep all predators away. It also squirts feces at intruders. The hoopo eats insects and worms. It has colorful crests. Crest, which it raises when excited. Starlings. Starlings are very common in the United Kingdom, where there are about 500,000 breeding pairs. The birds nest in spring, often in walls or attics. This can be a problem for homeowners, as the birds make lots of noises and produce lots of guano. The feces are though not only smelly, but they can also create carry diseases. In winter, thousands of migrate migrant starlings arrive in the United Kingdom from Eastern Europe. They stay there for the winter. Beastly bats. Many bats look very strange. Humans have made stories about bats being evil because of the way they look. But they actually do a lot of good eating. Good. 
eaten lies in numbers of harmful insects. The fringe lip bat gets its name from the gr gross of its lips and chin. Finger lip bat. The finger, finger, fringe lip bat lives in Central and Southern America. It eats insects, other bats, and frogs. Just by listening to the frogs' mating call, the bats can tell which way which frogs are poisonous and which are safety. Wrinkled face bat. The wrinkled face bat is found from southern Mexico to Venezuela. It has lots of hairless folds of skin on its face. The bat roosts in trees by day after dusk. It eats fruits such as ripe bananas. When roosting, the bat pulls up a fold of skin from its chin and hooks it over the top of its head, covering, covering its ears. Spectral bat. The spectral bat is one of the largest bats in the world. It has a wingspan of up to three feet, one meter. It, it is found in southern Mexico, Ecuador, Peru, Brazil, Guyana, Suriname, and Trinidad. The spectral bat hunts at night for birds, small mammals, reptiles, frogs, large insects, and, and fruit, and even other bats. Both parents take care of the single baby that is born each year. The father bat often sleeps with both the mother and the baby wrapped in their wings. The spectral bat has a long canine teeth. Foul fact. A spectral bat suddenly drops from a tree onto its prey as the prey passes below. Poisonous flyers. Some birds have developed an unusual pr protection against predators. There are poisonous in there they use poison in their feathers or skin to keep themselves safe from enemies. Quills are very small, only growing to six, about six through seven inches, um, 15 through 17.2 centimeters high. They have many predators, including humans. The pifo uh, may be brightly colored as a warning to predators that it is poisonous. Pitohus. Pitohus are songbirds from New Guinea. These birds have high level of poison in their feathers and skin and smaller amounts in their body. They eat a type of beetle that contains the poison. The poison may protect the birds from predators and parasites. Quails. Some European and Eurasian quails are not are poisonous, but not all of them and not all of the time. People who have eaten quail in northern Algeria, southern France, Greece, northeastern Turkey, and Russia have been known to suffer vomiting, breathing problems, pain, and even paralysis. The poison, foul fact, the poison in the feather of, of Ephrates is the same poison as that found in a poison dart frog. Blue Cape Ifritita. The Blue Cape Ifrita is a small insect eating bird found in New Guinea. It eats kerosene beetles, which contain poison. The poison is carried in the bird's blood and is laid down in its skin and feathers. This protects it from predators. The feathers of the Blue Cape Ifrita are beautiful but dangerous to touch. Thank you for watching the videos. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.